We the People provides you with a new way to create and join petitions encouraging the federal government to take action on a range of issues. If a petition gets enough signatures, White House staff will review it, ensure it's sent to the appropriate policy experts, and issue an official response. In this video, we'll show you how to create a WhiteHouse.gov account, sign a petition, and create a new petition. In order to create or sign a petition, you will need a WhiteHouse.gov account. Creating an account is easy. First, enter your name, zip code, and email address. An email with a verification link will be sent to that address. Simply click on the link in that email to verify your account. Once you've created an account and verified your email address, just click the Sign This Petition button to add your name. If you're not logged in already, you'll be asked to log in or create an account. Once you've signed a petition, help promote it by encouraging people you know to join you. It's also simple to create a new petition. A petition's title should complete the sentence, We believe the Obama administration should, clearly summarizing a federal action to be taken on an issue. Next, select up to three issue categories for the petition. Once you're done, click Save and Continue. Now, We the People searches for similar petitions. If you see one that is similar, you may want to sign that one instead of creating a duplicate. Joining a similar petition that already exists makes it easier to reach the threshold for an official response. If you still want to create a new petition, click Save and Continue. Next, you'll need to provide some additional information for the petition. You only have 800 characters, so be clear and concise. Once you've completed the description, you can add keywords or tags to your petition. Next, click Save and Continue. Now you can see a preview of what the petition will look like once it's live. Once a petition is live, it cannot be edited, so carefully review its title, description, and other parts. From this page, you can go back to make changes or corrections, or just save a draft for later. Once you are ready, finalize and publish the petition, which will also start the countdown to meet the signature threshold. Right now, only you know the web address of the petition, so hang on to it. An email with the link has been sent to you as well, which you can forward to others. It's up to you to share the petition with other people and gather signatures. If a petition meets the signature threshold in the given amount of time, it will be sent to the appropriate policy officials in the administration, who will issue an official response. Responses will be posted to whitehouse.gov on the petitions page and emailed to everyone who signed it. Thanks for checking out We the People. We're looking forward to hearing from you.